Hello, my name is Fernando Cardona. Um, I help uh, students pass the ASAP test. I have people in Puerto Rico and also I can uh, help people um, online via streaming. This is one of my online students. She's in the United States and she sent me a question. Uh, I'm going to try to help her out, see if she can understand it. She sent me um, this particular exercise. Let's see it. Okay, they're telling me that they have the area of one circle is four times as large as a smaller circle. So let's just draw a small circle. And uh, not that small, let's just draw a little bit bigger. That circle and a bigger circle. And uh, that's supposed to look like a circle. Okay. Um, they're telling me that the area of one circle is four times as large as a smaller circle. So I'm just going to call this um, area. This would be, I'm just going to write a little s as area small. And here I'm going to write a area b as area big, big circle. Um, let me just divide it here. Okay. And they're telling me that the smaller circle with a radius of three inches, the small circle has a radius of three inches. They just write R3. And they're telling me the radius of the larger circle is, okay, so they're basically asking me for the radius of the large circle. They're asking me for this. Uh, this is like my goal. Let me just, this is my goal. I want to find the radius of the larger circle. So my options, option A, B, C, and D are my radius large circle radius large my radius of my large circle okay so uh, 12986 12986 um, well all the information they're giving us is this and they're telling me that this area is actually four times so let me just write a four times okay so uh, I need to know the area of a circle uh, the formula it's pi r exponent 2 where r is your radius, and they're giving me the radius, so I can actually substitute in here a 3, and we would have, uh, yeah, the area would be pi 3 exponent 2. I'm going to, 3 exponent 2 is 3 times 3. That would be 9. So here I can write a 9 pi. Um, my area would be 9 pi. Okay, so I have this area, but remember, that we need to multiply by 4 to get the bigger area. So my bigger area could be um, 4 times 9 pi. I'm just going to write here 4 times 9 pi. And we know that 4 times 9 is 36, 36 pi. Okay, so I have the area of the bigger circle. But you know that, that, that going back to the formula, area is going to be pi r exponent 2. So um, basically I'm going to look at this and this. We know that our answers are r. So if I try, let's suppose, with 9, um, and I know that it's going to be r exponent 2. Uh, 9 exponent 2 is 9 times 9, 81. That doesn't work. You could try with 8 exponent 2. That's going to be 8 times 8, 64. That doesn't work. And then we can go with d. Um, 6 exponent 2, it's 6 times 6, 36, would, would actually solve my equation. So it's going to be letter d. Um, basically, if you substitute the 6 into this, you're going to get um, 36 pi. And that's basically what you want to get. So that's my answer for my R. Um, I hope the video helped you guys. Um, my name is Fernando Cardona. I uh, help people pass the ASAP. I got a 94 AFQT and a 125 GT. I've had um, various students that's done very successful. Um, you guys could check my Facebook. Um, my email is going to be written somewhere here. So you could send me an email also. Um, thank you very much. Take care.